So today we talk about returns or refunds, what we do actually when a customer is telling us that he wants to return his product. What's up guys, I hope you have a great day. Today we talk about returns. So what we actually do when a customer is uh, telling us that he wants to refund his product so due to the fact that we don't have a warehouse um, what do we do actually with the product itself so the way we do it is that we tell the customers to send this product back to us here to our home um, we will do a quality check and after that he will get his money back so the customer sends the product back to your home and what you can do now is that you can send this product to the next customer if the product is not damaged obviously um, this allows you to send the product out for much higher profit because you already paid that product it is already here so what you want to do is to give the customer different options to arrange somehow deal with the customer for example you could tell him dear customer um, we apologize that you don't like our product or for any reason that something is not fitting um, are you willing to take a five dollar refund which for example you have a twenty dollar um, product you sold it for 40 and you can still make a deal that you at least get rid of your cost you don't have any lost through that refund so this is a way to handle with the, to arrange with the customer somehow to keep your returns lower and obviously if the customer still denies it and he wants his complete money back then you just refund him and in certain cases when you have a really cheap product let's say just two three dollars um, the best way to deal with that in this scenario is to tell him dear customer we apologize that you don't like our product you can keep the product you don't need to send it back and we will refund you 100% so this is the best way to deal with the customer refund because you don't you want your customer to purchase over and over again so once they realize wow this company is really nice to me and gave me that product for free i think i will buy another product from them give him automatically a nice memory about the purchase and this will allow you to build a really strong relationship with your customers and they will buy over and over again so i hope this video helped and don't forget to subscribe and leave some questions in the comments and see you next time.